Greetings, library lovers. Welcome to the Morrow Memorial Library, Norwood's public library for everyone. I'm Clayton Cheever. I use he, his pronouns. I'm your library director. Kids ages 9 to 12 are invited to come to the library on Monday evening, September 16th at 6 to turn a t-shirt into a decorated tote bag to hold all your school supplies this year. We'll provide one t-shirt per participant and you can bring additional shirts. The best part? No sewing is required. Register your kid today as space is limited. Make sure you stop by our booth and say hello at Norwood Day this month, happening on Saturday, September 7th. We'll once again be hosting a henna artist so you can go home with some free henna body art. I recommend stopping by as early as possible. The line has gotten pretty long in past years. Our annual sustainability stash share is happening again this month. Drop off any odds and ends you have left over from past craft projects starting on Thursday evening, September 12th and all day on Friday the 13th and then come back for the stash share on Saturday, September 14th. No money, no trading, just bring a bag because you're certain to find something to take away as well. As the new school year starts, we can all benefit from focusing on our education. We have a great online tool to help. Our great courses library collection is accessible through the Libby app or directly from the online resources page found under the reference and research menu on our website. Once you get through and get the free seven day pass, you'll have access to hundreds of unique courses to feed your curiosity. Each lesson's about 30 minutes long and sample a, you can sample a few or get serious and take an entire course. It's self-directed learning at its finest. We're happy to make recommendations, just ask us. You can learn to draw, improve your understanding of investments, dive into music theory and so much more. Why not get started today? Are you ready to dive in some fantastic reads? Whether you're young or young at heart, we've got something special for everyone. Let's jump right in. First up, for young explorers, we have Squawk of Spanish by Gabriela Aldman, illustrated by Romina Galata. This delightful picture book takes us on a bilingual adventure with a parrot who loves to squawk in Spanish. It's a fun and engaging way for kids to pick up some new words while enjoying a colorful story. It's perfect for sparking a love of languages early on. Next, we have We the People by Ora Lewis and Evan Sargent. This book is a vibrant and accessible introduction to U.S. Constitution for kids. With its lively illustrations and easy to understand explanations, it makes learning about history and civics a blast, and it's a great way to inspire young minds to think about their role in our democracy. Now, for our more experienced readers, let's turn to Dare to Speak, Defending Free Speech for All by Suzanne Nossel, the CEO of PEN America. This powerful book is a must-read for anyone interested in free speech and its complexities in today's world. Nossel provides a thoughtful guide on how to navigate the challenges of speaking up while respecting others. It's insightful, timely, and incredibly relevant. Finally, we have Jimi Hendrix, Live in Lviv by Audrey Kirkov. This novel is a quirky and captivating tale set in the Ukrainian city of Lviv. It weaves together the lives of the eccentric characters with the spirit of Jimi Hendrix, creating a unique and unforgettable story. It's a perfect pick for those who enjoy a mix of humor, history, and a touch of the surreal from an author long listed for the Booker Prize last year. So there you have it, four fantastic books to add to your reading list. May you find a cozy sun puddle and enjoy some great times reading. Now, all this time taking care of your mind, I hope you're also working to take care of the rest of your body. I have something here that you can do while you're reading, a set of hand grip strengtheners. In between your visits to the gym, you can keep working on your hand strength with this easy to use tool. You simply set the resistance to preferred level and let the built-in counter keep track of your reps. Try it out and see if you want to get your own or just borrow ours occasionally, much like I use our cookbooks. This hand grip strengthener and so many other great games, tools, puzzles, and more can be found in our library of things. Visit our website and browse our library of things from the books and more menu to see what other treasures we have waiting for you. Before I sign off, I want to thank our dear friends of the library. The friends provide program support throughout the year, including the funds for crafts and supplies for programs for kids and teens. Please make sure you have an active membership in the Friends and support them whenever possible as they make possible so much of what we present here. We are so grateful for all the support. That's a wrap for this Moral Moment. I'm Clayton Cheever, your guide through the wonders of the library, wishing you a sweet September. We can't wait to see you at the library. 
and at the weekly farmer's market every Tuesday through the end of the month.